So this one documentary. Yeah. Or like a part of the documentary. Don't be in front of my camera if you don't want to be on my channel. Hey everybody, welcome to the Hamakua Homestead. If you're new here, my name is Tiffany and today we are doing a product review. A company called Love Moment decided that they wanted to send me a package. So we're gonna try it out. This is a battery powered, battery powered vacuum sealer. And the cool thing about this is I brought this up to my friends and a couple of them actually already have this and they seem to really like it. So I'm excited to try this out. Nice pretty package. I've never had a vacuum sealer before. This is the extent of the instructions. Looks fairly simple to operate. There it is. It's rechargeable. It has a type C charger. I hope it came with batteries. I don't have any batteries. At least I don't think I do anyway. Came with some generic lids to try out with. That's cool. Charger. It's got a little bit of instructions on here. It says it explains how to convert wide mouth regular mouth. Oh. <laughs> you have to line them up. Easy. <laughs> I don't need to worry about batteries. The charging port is on the top. LED light shows you how long it's on and a power button. Seems very easy. How to use. <laughs> you literally stick it on top of your mason jar and turn it on. It also does, re it does say that it recommends that you not exceed the thread on the mason jar, not to go above the thread on the mason jar and to keep the edge of it clean, just like you do when you're canning or anything else. You know, get the food particles off of there. Okay. It literally just says, push the button to take the air out and then once it's done taking the air out, push it again and take it off. Trouble is, I don't have anything I need to vacuum seal right now. Let's go find something to vacuum seal. So this is a regular mouth. It says inside regular mouth jars. Pop it on there all the way. It says it's at 71%. I think that's the battery. Cool. I wonder what my son's gonna say when he sees his toothpicks. but it doesn't fit in his drawer. Let's find something else. I'm pretty certain it worked. How about a jar of rocks? This is just stuck on there from age for sure. These are rocks that we collected from the beach. Okay, so this is now a wide mouth. So now I guess we just you can see right here, super easy, lock and unlock. And it says inside there, wide mouth. I'm trying to figure out how you know it's done, but the instructions don't necessarily say. It just says press the button to start the machine until the air in the bottle is evacuated, then press the button again. <laughs> Vacuum sealed rocks. <laughs>
baking soda. Now let's try it on a smaller jar. Red pepper flakes. I'm pretty certain that I figured out how to tell when the machine is done. There's no button or light or anything to tell you that, but, but it starts to make a different type of sound. And I think that that's when it has run out of air to suck out of your container. Cereal. Okay, in that instance, I definitely had it on crooked. I didn't have it on all the way on one of the sides. So let's try it again. Hear how it changes the sound? I think that means it's done. Lamps. Q tips. Your boyfriend's cell phone charger. Mm -hmm. Until the sound. Garlic. A sponge. Is it sucking all the carbonation out of your soda? Soda. I feel like because of the carbonation, it could have stayed on longer than that, and it would have actually taken the carbonation out. It's flat. I think it's pretty flat. Well, you guys, as you could tell, I kind of had a little bit of fun with this. I think it's a winner for sure. Super easy to use. That's all you gotta do to change the lids. Super easy. And I'm a big fan of common uh, charger ports. So that's a big plus too. I might not have any real need for a vacuum sealer quite yet just today, but I certainly will stay tuned for more videos. I am going to be doing some dehydrating pretty soon, some basil and oregano out of the garden. And I think this bad boy is definitely gonna come in handy for that. So if you guys wanna go ahead and check out this handy dandy vacuum sealer, check the link in the description box below and you can go ahead and grab one right off of Amazon using that link. Thank you for joining me today on the Hamakua Homestead. I'll see you again soon. It's stuck. Ow! <laughs>